Tony Schiavone interviewed the uh, the bell of the ball of Rampage Rating CM Punk, one of the best interviews in the business, who got out five words before Eddie Kingston comes in yelling at him and they get in interaction. I'm not saying that angle shouldn't have happened, but the the timing of that nobody ever gets a chance to say anything. What would they have said if they had not been interrupted on all these million times, all these people? They obviously had something to say they were out there. Can can we get something out from the but anyway? Kingston comes in. Yelling at Punk. Punk is very fucking believable in, in fucking jousting back with him. And a bunch of people herded Eddie Kingston out. So I'm assuming that this is leading somewhere. I really like this. And I understand your point. Punk's one of the best talkers there. And he's also someone that moves the needle. Give him more time. But if you're going to do something like this, which is a little bit of an angle, do it Friday night. <laughs> if there's ever going to be a time <laughs> to not let Punk talk too much, there's this, and I thought it was interesting, and Punk played it really well, and Kingston, again, he's really believable. So the idea of Punk's about to talk, and all of a sudden, an angry Eddie Kingston comes into the back, yelling about the fact the referee stopped the match, and then he gets in Punk's face. I love this. I thought this was tremendous. I've, well, I'm not saying that once they got into it, it wasn't good. I'm just saying, let him say something first. It's just, if, again, every interview, 